Flow, this is Hector with Tequila Reviews and more. Today we're going to check out this 2022 uh, Badlands Bronco. <clears throat> remember a couple of uh, weeks ago we made a video of our last um, Bronco that was uh, actually totaled. So this is what we replaced it with. Um, it was really hard to actually find it, but we did some research. We were able to find a good uh, black uh, Bronco here with the hard top, which is something that we really wanted. So instead of of uh, getting a soft top and later on getting a hard top, we just went ahead and bought one with an actual hard top. So let's go check out what this Bronco actually came with and what we just added. All right, so if we do a walk around on this Bronco here, this is a 2022 Bronco Badlands and you can see that emblem right there. It is not the Sasquatch edition. It did not come with those 35 inch tires. It actually comes with these 33 inch tires. Now these rims here um, were ordered for this Bronco and it was an upgrade I'm going to say about $900 or $1,000. You know what? They do look pretty nice. I don't think these are going to be, I'm going to be replacing. Now as for making or getting some slightly larger tires, I might do that. But definitely keeping those uh, rims there. I actually like them more than the Sasquatch uh, rims. Now if you if you don't know much about the this edition here, it does it is a little bit higher than our last one which is a black diamond it still comes with that with that rock crawler um, bar here in the bottom to protect the, the the Bronco okay now for some reason they upgraded a lot of little things they actually added this this protection um, plastic here on each corner uh, of the of the of the Bronco so we went ahead and and left those on there okay going around you can see that it is a hard top. Here's that, here's that corner here again. And the, in the front, I actually added that, that the hood scoop there, okay? Um, if you buy it from Ford directly, it's about $480. Um, I actually got it on Amazon, a little bit under 200, I wanna say 180 or 150. Um, so I added that on there. In the front, I also added these orange uh, rings that actually match with the, with the interior. Also, even you know here you'll see these uh, plastics here. They also went ahead and purchased this this protector here also. So we went ahead and left them on there. I kind of like it just to make it a little bit different than than every other Bronco. So I left that on there. Let's let's go ahead and check out the, the inside. All right. So for the inside. Um, it, this this edition does come with the plastic um, instead of the carpet in the bottom here. Those uh, washout version here. It also comes with with um, the marine grade uh, seats. So it, this is not leather, but it does have that really nice orange stitching that goes that goes with everything that's inside this this orange here. I do like this orange more than my last one. Uh, which was a black diamond because that, that one was more of a blue so you can see this little orange coming across here on the stitching on there on the center there you'll see it on the ac vents here okay now this is a um a higher package so it did come with a with a larger screen um and all these buttons here our last one was missing two buttons here I believe this is the sway disconnect and this is the front differential lock. Now our last one must have just had from here back, which is your rear differential lock and, and everything else. So these two here are definitely going to be helping if you're off-roading. Uh, this version also comes with all the controllers, all the auxiliaries here, and that is for pretty much uh, the pre-wired version and, and, there, and then you can start adding all the accessories and, and uh, lights all around. Okay, So on the inside. Um, I also noticed that the last one we had was a two-tone uh, pleather here, marine grade vinyl. Um, this one seems to be all one color, so it seems to be just a, a darker gray. Okay, I do like it. I'm not sure if I like it more than my than my last Bronco. And then the main thing that we really wanted was this was this hard top. Okay, the reason we wanted this hard top is because it reduces the, the, the noise and you're still able to make it convertible. <clears throat> so we're able to have a little bit of both, you know, that, that, that hard top 
and then and then be able to remove it now we have noticed that it's pretty expensive to to add that on there it's about six to seven thousand dollars if you want if you want to buy it after so we went ahead and just paid a little extra for the for the higher trim and and that that came came with it but we also added the the plastic mats they do they are from ford and they come with the with the logo um i'm trying to buy a mat for the back and if i buy it from ford again it will come with the logo so i have for my last one i had purchased uh, one from amazon and it looked really nice but it, it didn't have the actual logo so i kind of just want to buy it from ford so so that it gets that little bronco logo here so here's the back the top here's the back and the top you just pull it up it doesn't have a a latch or anything but the door does have to be um almost completely open to be for for that to actually be be able to come up but here it is it does have a lot of space back here so really really enjoy the the four door now to to remove this this uh, top i've seen videos where they just take out one two three screws and then on on each side and that's how we get the back part off the, the front parts are just um they just have like little clips that you can just remove and the, and that should be able to come off now let's check out the upgrade that this vehicle came with um again it's a 2022 uh, four-door advanced 4x4 badlands five passenger 2.7 EcoBoost V6 engine with a 10 speed auto transmission. Now that's not necessarily included because if you really, if we look at the equipment added right here, you'll see that equipment group 333A for $2790, almost $3000 for that Badland series. Of, oh, it is a mid package. Sorry if I said the high package. Dual zone electric climate control, front row heated seats, power outlets. Ford Co-Pilot 360. Not sure what that is. Oh, see, so here we have the high package. So the high package uh, section was 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 part of it with a 12-inch LCD stack touchscreen, 360-degree camera. So that 360-degree cameras are actually really, really, really nice. Then we see additional equipment. Here we have the 2.7 liter V6 engine was 1895. The 10-speed transmission 1595. Then they added the hard top. Uh, now to upgrade from the soft top to the hard top, it's only about seven hundred dollars. Definitely worth it. But of course, uh, you know that was delaying some Broncos being being delivered. Uh, front bumper modular front bumper five seventy five. Definitely worth it. Uh, then we have our seventeen inch aluminum wheels nine ninety five. Almost a thousand dollars. And then of course the body armor that I was talking about, um, protective molding five hundred dollars. I believe that comes installed. Um, so we went from 46590 to nine plus the additional 9045 uh, price now 55635 destination delivery 1595 brought this to a total of 57230 now that is before they start adding the markup now the, most dealers are adding are still adding markups on these Broncos because they're so scarce, they're so hard to get. Uh, we're very specific on having a an, another black one, and and finding that that hard top. I was really looking for a Sasquatch package, but I couldn't find one other than a Wild Track. Um, and that Wild Track, they definitely wanted that premium price. They wanted uh, ten thousand. Uh, I think they took it down to nine thousand after negotiating uh, above MSRP, and I just wasn't willing to pay that much. So I did go with a lower package, and and um, with this one here, I did end up paying about five thousand above MSRP. But it's definitely definitely uh, worth it because that hard top itself is going to end up costing you about six thousand later on. So you might as well get it if you really want it. Uh, if you if you don't mind that soft top, you know there's nothing wrong with it. It's easier to make convertible. I just after having the soft top, I just wanted the hard top. So hope you guys enjoy. Uh, hit the thumbs up on the video. Subscribe for more uh, of these of these videos, especially this is Bronco. As I'm updating it or upgrading it and putting all these extras, I will uh, continue to send you guys or put put up some videos. Have a great day.